metaverse NFT game. SimCity um, legend Will Wright is making a metaverse NFT game on the blockchain, which is really quite bullish because, you know, SimCity is a massive, massive game. Mm -hmm. um, been there since 2008. And now he wants to sort of relaunch it in the metaverse. Um, and and uh, they're expecting that it should be ready soon. Uh, they said they've actually shelved it a little bit, um, so they're pretty much ready to go. Yeah. Um, it says it's also helpful to sell NFTs. The game's been designed at uh, Gallium Studios, a studio focused on blockchain gaming. But the Vox characters uh, in the heart of it are on existing lines of NFTs, stuff like the Trolls and the Walking Dead. The Vox characters are sold by crypto firm Gala Games. They've spent 25, Gala Games has spent $25 million funding Voxverse. Um, again, I think you and I could have done it for at least half of 25 million. <laughs> No comment. But very interesting. Did you ever play? Oh, you said you're not a not a big gamer. Nah, I, I play. I played a little bit. So I played a little bit of of Sims, like very, very, very early when they first kind of were. I mean, I don't know when they first came out, but it was very early in in their like journey. And I was a fucking child, and I remember like this game, Webkins, and maybe maybe like one other. Like I think I tried RuneScape or something like that. Uh, but never been a big guy. It just wasn't that fun. I was just like running around. I was like, what the fuck? This is stupid. Like <laughs> I used to love Diablo. It was one of my it was one of my favorites. Obviously, Grand Theft Auto um mm. came out when I was like about 20, and that was just a game changer. That was just so awesome. <laughs> um yeah, I used to play, but there was another game, there was a game called Black and White. Bro, I loved this game. You were basically, and it's not because I'm a megalomaniac, you were God, okay? So you, you were God, and you you had your own city, and you had a pet that would help you do stuff, and people would pray to you, like from the perspective of, please help my daughter with this. And, and if you were a merciful God, you got the support of the community. And if you were like a strict God, you got their fear. And depending on that, I loved it. Um, guys, let me know in the comments if anyone's played black and white. I know it's probably be before most viewers' time. Yeah, I'm I think I struggled. In a few months. I, I struggled a little bit with, um, I think like my whole life with it, with like the Im immersiveness of certain things. Like, I really like movies that can just draw you in, and within five minutes, you're in. Like, you're you might as well be in the movie because it's that immersive. And I, I just like if it's anything less than that, I just really struggle with getting into it. Like plays. Um, anything that's like live it's sometimes it's just not as it's not as curated as like something that's been edited right like if you have a fully edited video versus just like the the normal stream it's just not as good and it's not as immersive uh and i think for me i just struggle with that because a lot of times i would see the um the immersive one first or like i would see the fan of the opera movie first and then go see it live and i'd be kind of disappointed with the live one because the movie was so well put together same with the games like i'd be playing the game and i'd want to be spider-man or whatever character i'm playing in a video game and I'm like, bro, I don't feel like Spider-Man, though. You know, I'd rather go watch Spider-Man or go do something that's going to make me feel better about myself. But I feel like I'm just, like, playing a character that's not me and I'm never going to be this. And I don't feel like this character that I want to be. So it's not even fun. I just feel like I'm a – I just feel like a, I don't even know. Like, I was wasting my time or something. Yeah. I mean, yeah, uh, yeah. I don't know. It depends I don't know. if you've got enough time to get into these things. I'm just not being a game. They just grab you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know. All right. So we got Apple Store back in the news now. So we broke that that story.